We've been watching legends on the pitch in the build-up to this Champions League final. I'm joined by a European legend now, Patrick Kluivert. Hi. Patrick, obviously you're out here playing a bit of a six-a-side. There's some great, great action on show here. But we're all, of course, in town for a huge game this weekend. Manchester City, what have you made of their growth under Pep Guardiola? Well, um, do we have a second? <laughs> no, I think that Pep, uh, when I played with Pep in Barcelona, he already signed that he's uh, uh, a director. He uh, knows how to put every individual in their position to make the team work. And I think that that uh, is what he did uh, for years and years. And this is the year he's, when he probably might uh, get the three biggest prizes in, in, in football in club history. And I think that, um, you know, he's got uh, all the players uh, in his team to uh, make uh, the, the Champions League final uh, to be Manchester City uh, tomorrow. You mentioned the treble. He did that when he was at Barcelona 2009, that first season. But how much more difficult is that, doing that in England? Well, first of all, the first in Barcelona was uh, not that easy. But to do it, uh, and you know, uh, he's got all the papers to do it uh, in a different club. Um, of course, he knows what kind of players he wants in his team, what um, characteristics certain positions uh, uh, ask. And he, he did it. And, and, and I think that tomorrow, with all respect, Inter don't have a chance to win from Manchester City. Can I ask you about Erling Haaland? Because when you came through, you are this young striker scoring so many goals in domestic leagues, in Europe, winning trophies. What have you made of Erling Haaland's growth? Well, I think that uh, if you see what he uh, does in his first season in Manchester City, I don't know how many uh, hat-tricks he had uh, in, in the first, I don't know, uh, six games he had five hat-tricks. Um, I think this, 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 this guy is unreal. Um, the way he moves uh, on the pitch, he is like a predator. He scores goals for fun. Uh, in what way? Also question mark because he makes the craziest move to make the goals. And um, yeah, for Manchester City, he's really important to, to score the goals. And you know, he 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 yeah, he's, he's an amazing player, an amazing striker. Do you think he's the best in the world right now as a striker? One of the best for sure, if not the best. And what makes him so special? You talk about that there is movement, but what is it? I mean, is there more to it? I mean, is it natural ability? Is it the way he works on his game? What, what have you seen? Well, I think it's, it's also important that uh, you have to look at uh, the players who he plays with. Um, if you see around him, Kevin De Bruyne, Mares, you name them, and, and, and you know, uh, Bernardo Silva. They have a team, he's got a team around him who makes it also difficult to, to uh, easy to score. And I think it's also thanks to them uh, to, to, to let him score so many goals. Because with all respect, if you, look, if you compare him to uh, Mbappé, Mbappé is more like a player who's making the runs in, in, in front and, and you know, also scoring. So I think Haaland and Mbappé are at the moment uh, yeah, the best uh, uh, players in, 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 in the competitions. And just uh, finally then, and we'll finish on the final itself. You think that Manchester City will win? How do they win the game tomorrow night? Well, I think they have the mindset to, don't get me wrong, eh, with uh, Inter it's, it's not that easy because they're playing a system. And if, you know, they're going to play with five behind, it's very difficult to, 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 to get the, the, the spaces in the team. But I think really it will be 3-0 or 4-1 or, or for Manchester City. They will, if they score an early first goal, uh, things were getting very, very difficult for Inter. Lovely stuff. Patrick Clive, thank you very much. Thank you. I know you've got a game to play. Patrick Clive then with us on Sky Sports News, head of the Champions League final. Cheers.